Autodesk simulation mechanical software allows designers and analysts to go beyond their linear structural analysis needs by taking into account nonlinearities. Some customers start out with known assumptions about what is nonlinear in the model, while others may run a linear static or dynamic analysis and see something that just doesn't look quite right about the results. Why? A nonlinear analysis just may answer this question. Let's take a look at the various nonlinear analysis types in Autodesk Simulation Mechanical product. MES with nonlinear material models takes into account nonlinearities while also allowing for large motion that exists in events such as drop test analyses or models that involve large sliding contact. Static stress with nonlinear material models will also account for the same nonlinearities, however, ignores time dependent effects. Natural frequency modal with nonlinear material models solves for natural frequencies while allowing for complex material models such as viscoplastic or hyperelastic to be used. MES RICS analysis is the same as the MES analysis above, but adds the ability to handle instabilities such as buckling automatically. Autodesk nonlinear analyses allow you to take into account material, geometric, and loading or boundary condition nonlinearities. Let's take a look at the various nonlinear material models first. The material models are organized in an intuitive, easy to use list. Virtually any material can be simulated. Using a stress strain material model for a steel structure will allow you to study whether design will still be safe if any areas go plastic. Soft elastomers such as rubber seals that strain hundreds of percent can be set up as well. Another type of nonlinearity is geometric nonlinearity. This occurs when the stiffness of the structure or model changes during the loading process. Geometric nonlinearities like the snap through action of an oil can or stiffening effects inherent in applying pressure to thin walled enclosures are typical examples. Loading and boundary conditions can also have nonlinearities that are accounted for in Autodesk nonlinear simulations such as sliding contact as shown in this plastic clip analysis. Notice the amount of change in the pressure loading direction in this simple plate analysis. So in summary, we have seen multiple reasons why engineers and designers use Autodesk nonlinear analyses, staying in the same easy to use interface that they are already familiar with. Thanks for watching.